Adolphe Edouard Casimir Joseph Mortier, first Duc de Trévis the 13th of February 1768 to the 28th of July 1835, was a French general and marshal of France under Napoleon I. He was one of 18 people killed in 1835 during Giuseppe Marco Fieschi's assassination attempt on King Louis Philippe I. Topic: Biography. <inaudible> 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 Mortier was born at Le Coteau Cambrésis on the 13th of February 1768, son of Charles Mortier (1732–1808) and wife Marie Anne Joseph Bonner B. 1735, and entered the army as a sub lieutenant in 1791. Topic: <laughs> Revolutionary and Napoleonic Wars. He served in the French Revolutionary Wars in the campaigns of 1792 and 1793 on the northeastern frontier and in the Netherlands, and subsequently on the Meuse and the Rhine. Mortier was tasked by Hatchery to negotiate the surrender of the Fortress of Mainz, which he completed successfully and then returned to Paris. In the war against the Second Coalition in 1799, he was promoted successively General of Brigade and General de Division. During the Second Battle of Zurich, he led a force of 8,000 in the attack from Diatacon on Zurich. His conduct of the French occupation of Hanover, bringing about the Convention of Artlenburg, led Napoleon to include Mortier in the first list of marshals created in 1804. He commanded a corps of the Grande Armée in the Ulm campaign in which he distinguished himself. In the campaign of the Middle Danube, which culminated in the Battle of Austerlitz, Napoleon placed him in command of a newly formed eight. Corps, composed of divisions from the other corps. Mortier overextended his line of march on the north shore of the Danube and failed to heed Napoleon's advice to protect his north flank. A combined force of Russians and Austrians, under overall command of Mikhail Kutuzov enticed Mortier to send Theodore Maxime Gazin's 2nd Division into a trap and French troops were caught in a valley between two Russian columns. They were rescued by the timely arrival of a 2nd Division, under command of Pierre Dupont de Laetong's 1st Division, which covered a day's march in a half day. The Battle of Dorenstein the 11th of November 1805 extended well into the night. Both sides claimed victory, the French lost more than a third of the participants, and Gazin's division experienced over 40% losses. The Austrians and Russians also had heavy losses—close to 16%. After Austerlitz, Napoleon dispersed the corps and Gazin received the Legion of Honor, but Mortier was simply reassigned. When the War of the Fourth Coalition broke out in 1806, Napoleon ordered Mortier to assume command of the newly formed Eighth Corps on 1 October. He was to coordinate his operations with Louis Bonaparte's Franco Dutch troops. On 16 October, two days after his crushing victory over Prussia at Jena Auerstedt, Napoleon ordered Mortier and Louis to conquer the electorate of Hesse. Mortier was to occupy Fulda and then the capital city castle, rule as military governor and imprison the Elector of Hesse. William I. Every Hessian officer above the rank of lieutenant would be arrested and Napoleon stated his intention to wipe the house of Hesse Castle from the map. Mortier knew this constituted a violation of Hessian neutrality and boasted on 17 October that its very neutrality made it easy to conquer. On 1 November, the French occupied and looted Castle, discovering that William had fled. Mortier issued a proclamation in which he claimed to have come to avenge Prussian violation of Hessian neutrality but also accused them of being Prussian allies. Mortier left a division to hold Hesse Castle, while the rest of his corps was directed to mopping up operations in Prussia. Hamelin capitulated on of November, along with a garrison of 10,000 Prussian troops. Nienberg fell on 29 November, with 2,911 Prussian soldiers marching into captivity. In 1807, he served in the Friedland Campaign, in the Siege of Stralsund, and in the Siege of Kohlberg. In 1808, Napoleon created him Duke of Treviso Trevis in French, a duché grand fief, a rare, but nominal, hereditary honour, extinguished in 1946 in his own Kingdom of Italy, and shortly after he commanded an army corps in Napoleon's campaign for the recapture of Madrid. Mortier remained in Spain for two campaigns, winning the victory of Ocaña in November 1809. In 1812 and 1813 he commanded the Imperial Guard, and in the defensive campaign of 1814 he rendered brilliant services in command of rearguards and covering detachments. 
In 1815, after the flight of Bourbon King Louis XVIII of France, he rejoined Napoleon during the saint jour and was given command of the Imperial Guard, but at the opening of the Battle of Waterloo he was unable to continue due to severe sciatica. <laughs> Post-war career After the Second Bourbon Restoration he was for a time in disgrace, but in 1819 he was readmitted to the Chamber of Peers and in 1825 received the Order of the Holy Spirit, the kingdom's highest. In 1830–1831 he was Ambassador of France to Russia at St. Petersburg, and in 1834–1835 Minister of War and President of the Council of Ministers. Death. On 28 July 1835, Mortier was one of those accompanying King Louis-Philippe of France to a review of the Paris National Guard, an annual event that commemorated the July Revolution that brought Louis-Philippe to power in 1830. In the Boulevard du Temple the royal party was hit by a volley of gunfire from the upstairs window of a house. Eighteen were killed, including Mortier, and twenty-two injured. The king received a minor wound. The weapon used was a homemade volley gun, constructed and fired by Giuseppe Marco Fieschi for the purpose of assassinating Louis Philippe. Fieschi had fixed 25 musket barrels to a wooden frame, and arranged that they could be fired simultaneously. Four of the barrels burst when fired and Fieschi was badly wounded. He was quickly captured and later tried with two co-conspirators. The three went to the guillotine in February 1836. Topic. Family Mortier married Eve Anne Hims, Koblenz, the 19th of August 1779, Paris, the 13th of February 1855, by whom he had issue. Caroline Mortier de Trevise, 1800 to 1842, married to Marie Hippolyte de Galois, second Marquis of Rumigny. Marie Louise de Galois de Rumigny ex Ludovic Marie, Count Dursel, 1809 to 1886. Hippolyte, Count Dursel. Sophie Malvina Josephine Mortier de Trevise, 1803. Napoleon Mortier de Trevise, 1804 to 1869, second Duke of Trevise. Edouard, 1806 to 1815. Louise, 1811 to 1831. Yves Stéphanie Mortier de Trevise, 1814 to 1831, Countess Goudin. 